Ooh, hello all, Series Lee's here, back some more of the Planet Crafter, and look what just unlocked, more inventory for the rover. Maybe we'll think about that later, but I think what I want to do today is even more exploring. We left off in the caves, exploring some of the ice caves last time, the ice maze. It starts all the way over there and does, it seems to connect. I don't know if it's eventually going to melt. We saw a connection into that tunnel yesterday. But I want to go up the ice mountain today and check out the inside and hopefully not get lost and suffocate and die. So let's go explore an ice maze while we just wait on stuff to get ready. Like food. Uh, yeah, we're like full up on food, right? So how much food are these worth? 40 and 35. Uh, mushrooms are useful. Well, so, so are these for tier two fertilizer, but I think we should probably eat these first. Or it's a lot more food, same as space food. And uh, we don't even have the ability to make tier one fertilizer yet, do we? Uh, lake water collector. Oh, yeah, look at that. We do have the tier one algae generator and we did start over in a puddle over there but uh, i think we need to wait a little bit more on water to rise so we got food we got water uh we have some oxygen huts and we'll just pick up more pick up more as we go let's head upstairs first ah uh, You know what? There's tunnels over this way to explore. So we're going to go into this way. There should even be materials for more huts inside in that big open area. I mean, if we're worried, we can start picking stuff up now. So over these ro ice rocks here. Okay, we already have a hut in here, but why not pick up another one? Is that the three? That is the three, and yeah, we got everything. Cool, let's check out some blue crates. Oh yeah, we picked up some explosives last time. Uh, maybe... Maybe what we want to do is, oh yeah, we talked to that, can't grab that one. Do we want to go back and grab them for our explorations? Now nah, let's just keep looking around for now. Ooh, hello. Message on that one. Same one, okay. Ooh, didn't see this last time, I don't think. Uh, nothing super good in there, but we needed a drink anyway. Okay. We're going to need some oxygen soon, so let's think about that. Oh, we got floating in the air right there. Interesting. Nothing in here. Okay. I know we have a hut right behind us, but we're just going to pick this one up again in a sec anyway. Uh, I do want to see what each of these new flowers becomes when they grow in a flower spreader, but we don't have those yet either, so tough patooties. Now I recall we went up this way last time, grab that, yeah. I think we were even in this specific crevasse last time, but I'm looking around from different angles. I want to see if we can find one of those new crates. Oh, maybe we can cheat and look through the world. <laughs> no, it doesn't look like it's up there. There's a small ridge here. No, all right. Lots of tiny passages in here to hide stuff, but nothing is hidden in the ones that I'm looking in. Alright. So this gets us back up into 
the big cavern, I think, because it's all the way across the other end, like that is the solar panels. And our hut is way over there. I'm gonna put a hut right here and we'll leave this one. Need one of those. Let's see. Do we have, yeah, one of them and one of you. Get this chip out of the way. Tier two lights through the vehicle, okay. I did say I want to go up in here, but there's lots of other ways to go in the ice tunnels part of the maze before we go up the mountain. Let's see if we can learn what's what in here. Okay, I looked in there already. Nothing there. Here's the tunnel that we entered into. That'll get us back to the Osmium Cavern. Ooh. So we went this way last time. Let's start picking up resources. That's a door. Oh, I don't need that. Just need one more iron. There we go. Not that I think I can fit a hut in here. So turn on torch, flashlight, there we go. Okay, this is water now. That's neat, this is, ooh, fancy. Anywhere else to go in here? No, what does that say? Destroyed with explosives, okay. So there is stuff that we could have explored with explosives. Yeah, I'll take those. Doesn't seem to be anything else in this tunnel. Okay, should have built a hut for some air. Oh, uh, wait, this is, this is the other, we're up above. I didn't know there was a tunnel over there and over here, back outside. Huh, all right. We're not as lost as we thought. Uh, given that, I think <clears throat> we can just get out of, oh wait, where does this one go? Oh yeah, lots more ways to go, okay, okay. Let's hut up. Right? Yeah, I will take the iridium though. Yeah, we'll start with the left hand corridor. Okay, this one is not melted yet. It looks very deep. Doesn't say when it melts. Cool. That's where we came in, and the right-hand corridor leads to uh, more choices. <laughs> oh, this is new. Okay. We're going to go left first. Yeah, not thawed and otherwise a dead end. Okay. This one is thawed. There, it, ooh, hello. There we go. There is a new crate, a Starform Robotics container. That is cool. Of course, we don't have a flashlight in this mode. You know what I could do? Let's stitch together some. <laughs> yeah. Let's see what we get. Um, 600%, we got a star foam effigy, star form effigy, some more water, and that, I'm gonna take the Tuska seed too, that's useful. Cool, okay. 
So in the ice caverns, you go up, you go right, and you go right. And that leads to this room here, and then you go in the water. You, obviously, it needs to be melted. Uh, that melts at 5 UK. Huh. I thought we were at that. Starts melting, and we can't get over it yet. Okay. Left, left, down left no more chips I do want to see what that looks like oh neat it's not golden it's just miniature I love it cool that's great okay cool now we can go up the ice mountain and see what's inside at the tippy top. So I wonder how many of those, was it star form? Star form containers? I wonder how many there are. Okay, there's a way up. We went up that way last time. Oh, you know where? We have not gone. Uh, we came in here before we had the jetpack, and there was an ice wall we could have hopped over. And we have not gone back to check. It was not down this way. Well, maybe. Oh, hello. I don't think so. I don't think we've been here before. I'll take you that. Can I delete this? I can absolutely delete this and build this. This is right there. Instead of bringing it home to build the tier 3. There's a bunker right here. Hello, bunker. Um, hmm, ooh. Probably uh, is a doorway as well, if I delete all of that stuff. See, I can delete that and look over. Yeah. Oh, hello. Is that a tier three? Can I delete, delete? Aw. <laughs> okay, I can't delete those yet. Let's get out of here. Oh, is this the ice wall I could have hopped over? This is the ice wall I could have hopped over. Yeah. Okay. It's melted a bit. Probably could have gotten around it as well. Okay, fine. I mean, it's cool. It's good to know that that bunker is there. Let's go get some air and go upstairs. Wait, uh, that might not be the one I was thinking of. It was closer to that hut. Yeah, okay, that was not the ice wall I could hop over. Maybe these structures don't melt. It would really ruin this cave if those things ever disappeared. Ah, uh, I can't say that. Maybe it becomes even cooler looking. Well, warmer, but uh, more impressive looking. So yeah, it's not around the lake. It's through here. Yeah, that's the one. We looked in this. Yep. Oh, that just goes to the lake. Okay, fine. <laughs> Nothing. Okay. Let's hop upstairs. Pointed this way, let's go to this one first. Let's go up that ramp right there. Uh, yeah, it's, this way it looks like it's sealed off, so let's check this. The 
this might just be the way into that lower ice cave that we saw our way through the wall last time. We can't see through. Uh, sort of see through this one. It might be. I can't tell. Ooh, hello. Well, let's keep going up. Looks like there's something up here. Sticking out of the ground. Is that just a robot? No, it's one of these crystal thingies. An icy one. So we saw a brown sort of one over in that dark crystal area. May as well take the aluminum home. We'll run out of that quick enough. Alright, nothing else up here. Let's climb some let's parkour. Yeah, there's another one of them crystal things over there. Uh, I don't see a ramp up to that one. Let's go take that ramp up and see if there's tunnels and stuff. After some air, it's right there. And I think I'm, yeah, I'm still carrying a hut too. Over to that one, but we have not explored up here yet. Looks like there's another way up right there. Let's take a peek over this wall here. Uh, we're just higher up in the ice caves. Okay. Before we go up, we did not go around. What's this way? Oh, come on, really? There's nothing uh, nothing in here? Might, maybe that's just a pit you can fall in from above, or... Yeah, it doesn't seem like we're supposed to be climbing up there. Well, it was a dead end, fine. Don't want to admit it, but it was. Yeah. That's exactly where you... I knew it. <laughs> Hello. Lots of urinite. Another chip is what I'm a little bit more interested in, though. Nothing in this part itself. Darn. Take those Tuscas. Take the space food. Don't think I need that. And uranite probably. Is this that is this is not the shelf that I was looking at. Well this does seem to be a dead end. I mean there's there's that there. Are we supposed to just build a bridge? I mean, I'm willing. That'd be cool. Whoa! That's a hole in the world. And the other thing we could do is maybe something sneaky like climbing up this ice. some height and then we all the way across maybe hey we made it nice I don't know if we're supposed to be here Lilia tree seed cool we got the blue one prunia now we have the Lilia and now we're full <laughs> uh, oh we need oxygen that's what we need darn I'll take that and a humblina and build a hut. I was going to jump off the edge, but then we'd have to get back up here. Forgot that we had a hut. In fact, no, uh, maybe. There's some iron. No, just iron and the other stuff. Uh, okay. Well, that's how you get in from the outside. Interesting. Alright, we've got lots of room if we leave this hut. So, I can just grab a bit of air. I don't have to decode those chips. Uh, 
Yeah, that's more important, I think. So is that, look, 50% more, crazy. Oh, that's our first bean seed. I'm definitely gonna take that. That's way better food than anything else we got. There we go. And we still have food and water on us. Awesome stuff. Okay. Doesn't look like there's anything else hidden up here. I think we've been through the whole ice caves now. So let's see where this exit takes us out at. I think it's by that big crash ship. We just haven't come up this hill. Oh yeah, we came up there before and went that way. I don't think I even looked up here. I wouldn't have thought to climb this cliff, I bet. Neat. Uh, we've got a full haul, pretty much. Let's head home. Oh, wait. Is this... Is this another pathway? Or is this how I was supposed to get up? Maybe. Where does this lead, if anywhere? Ah, uh, nowhere. Okay. You know what, while we're here, I did want to do this eventually, we got a jetpack. I want to climb up the top of this thing on the outside. Just cause. And you know what, that seems like a place to hide, one of those new crates. At the top of the world. That seems to be the top. Let's head over there. We got a bit of air. very least we should get a nice vantage point from up here. That's a nice flat, oh, you know what, look at that. Oh, that's just a piece of yellow stuff floating in the air. Okay, never mind. Shush. <laughs> Alright, we don't have a lot of time here. Well, it was worth a look. There's the edge of the world on that side of the world. Okay, back down we go. I think that's our closest hut right there. Somewhere we thought was an impossibly high place to get just a few moments ago. All right, and then I think this is the fastest way home. Very tempted to go look in that crash ship. But I think we've ruined enough crates for today. Uh, well, this week, I guess. Blue crates, that is. Let's get these flowers going. We got two of the 600 percenters because of that blue crate that had one, which is neat. I mean, we're still using these in veggie tubes, not flower spreaders, for for goodness sakes. So, you know what? I think that's what we're going to spend the rest of today on, is seeing how the water's going and seeing if we can get an algae spreader in here. If not, we're going to try it in um, the ice caves. Ooh, that's important. And that's super duper important as well. Uh, boom. Methane we don't have yet, nor zeolite. Okay. That we can make. That one we can do. Uh, where did I put... Uh, why do I already forget what it takes? Explosive powder. That was here. Bean... Mm, we'll plant that in a sec. I want all of that stuff. There we go. I think that was it. 
That was it. Super ally we already had. Cool. Okay. <laughs> you know what? We need to make another rod, it looks like. Didn't bring home any uranium. That's okay. Oh, aluminum and super alloy are both full. We might have to take those out. There we go. You can live in there, uh, but there they are. These guys got to get plugged in here. May as well plug. Uh, where's the other one at? Right here. Take you guys out. Pick up a couple of you guys. We need more storage. For ev no. No. There we go. For everything else. There we go. Sure, doesn't matter. What do we need to get this going? Algae spreader, we need bioplastic, we need the eggplant. So we can do, in theory, four of these. We have four eggplants right now. These just finished growing. If this is our only food source, that's coming out. The bean's going in. Bada bing, bada boom. Don't need to eat that stuff yet. So we need super alloy, water bottle, and magnesium each. Bioplastic. Was it? No, just magnesium. Okay. Let's get this going right here if we can. It seems really shallow. I bet it'll let us build these, but I don't know that it'll start growing yet. Gross 2%. It's probably going to grow under the ground, unfortunately. <laughs> Uh, I might have to rebuild them when the water gets higher. You know what? Let's pick that up and let's bring that to the ice caverns. I think the fastest one to water is right there. And this does seem to be one of the lower points of the map. I'm surprised there's not more water in that bauxite area. Yeah, let's just build it in here. Uh, that's definitely deep enough and I don't think it's gonna rise. So there we go. Just in case the one by home base doesn't work. We gotta be pretty vigilant on grabbing the algae from these if we wanna get serious about making fertilizer and stuff. <clears throat> Unfortunately, so we really want this water to rise because being close to base would be way better. I can't believe we haven't found any fertilizer yet. That's just preposterous to me. That really is our bottleneck, isn't it? Because we have a flower spreader. We could put out more grass spreaders. We've got a lot of lerma beads. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Where'd I put those guys? Over here. Two, four, we could put out three more. <laughs> three more grass spreaders. A ton, a metric ton. What else, water, is that it? Two water each, huh? All right. There we go. But as best we can do for the mow, I mean, we doubled our biomass just there, but it's not a big amount. Uh, what else could we do? What else could we do? Uh, we could put in important stuff like that. Can we do the gas yet? No, that's that's still unlocked from pressure. 
we can put in more drills. We're at not even a tenth of the way to our first gas extractor. We're almost at the lake water collector. Well, we're halfway to the lake water collector. Yeah, I think what we really need to do is set up a bunch of rockets. Honestly. Because... Wait a minute, did we even unlock that rocket yet? Seed spreader rocket. No, we did not. Or the plants rocket. Hmm. I really don't want to do building. All right, we're doing more exploring. <laughs> just because I don't want it. Grab two of these. I'm just going to drink one as well. And I don't want to eat any of that. Except that. There we go. We'll eat that guy. Let's head up here and check out these caves. Let's see. Oh, one thing. Before we go, we saw five UK for some of the unlocks there. Uh, we're at 10 UK. Maybe it was NK we saw. Okay. KKK. Oh, that's not cool. Uh, oh, there, look, the algae does grow here. Uh, I don't see any of these stalks that I can look at yet to see how to see if they're grown. They won't be grown. I just want to see the game say not grown yet oh 200 MTI that's just regular terraformation index we're a tenth of the way there same for that that. I'm going to assume these were all 200. We checked these before, but I forget. Yep. This is sort of maze-like. Hello? Were we supposed to be able to get in here? We haven't been in here yet. Well, we found somewhere new. Fertilizer. No. I almost don't want any of this stuff. We're full of this stuff. Oh, hello. Take that. We're unlocking some stuff that we can't build yet, so it's, it's sort of pointless to get those, but look at all of this stuff. Hello. This is cool. Okay, I want to go back because we're out of air. And uh, I'm already lost, so I want to figure out how we got in here. That was fluke. That was not figuring anything out. Okay, so it's on that left, right, left hand side of the far one. Okay. Yeah, look at that. Uh, atmospheric water collector. Uh -huh. Oh, hey, pulsar quartz. Yoink, that's my first pulsar quartz. Another bunker. An ore crusher. 
There's my first zeolite, very important. I don't have a lot of bauxite, so I'll grab that just for posterity's sake. Osmium, sort of rare. Oh, I can't delete that or take stuff out of it. That's unfortunate. It's really dark in here at night. Really, really dark. Here's some, oh, here is some water. Interesting. It's fairly close to base, but it's a bit of a maze to get to it, and I wouldn't want to have to do it at night. I sort of want to see what's under the water, but it's night, and I can't even see where we just came from. Oh, there it is. Jeez. <laughs> what is this? I saw a silhouette. Oh, it's this. Okay. Let's build our hut. That's pretty high up. I got a jetpack, though. It's fine. Ah, there's some light. Um... Silicone, eh? There we go. I bet there's some more chips to unlock in the bunker as well. I bet it's actually brighter in the bunker than it is in the cave at night. Circuit boards in those things now. That's interesting. I like that. Still no fertilizer. All right, the task is harder than I thought. Those drones are really smart and most of the time they are doing their task with great intelligence. It's not always easy to hide the modifications I did on them and how I lured them or hacked them. Hmm. But I already handled some of them. The star, staff foam, probably star form. Robotics technology is really impressive. No wonder Sentinel Corp is scared. I think I picked up oxygen there too. More circuit boards. Hello. So I can't get them from these things yet, but I can get them from robots. Cool. Uh, I was wrong. There were no more microchips in here. Okay. And I can see again. Let's go take a dip in that water over there. Ooh, here's a frog pond in the future. Okay, it's very shallow. But I wouldn't have been able to see that it was very shallow at night. So it was worth waiting until day. Couldn't see that crate before. Another frog pond, one of these thingamajiggers. Okay, we'll go further down. And maybe try picking up another hut. short of another hut. But we're already full, so. Take that. There's a biodome down there. Oh, this area is huge. Nothing fancy in these things, though. I mean, we are at the stage where we need organic stuff like fertilizer. And the game is not being generous with us. It's the first time we've seen one of these ramps. Can I delete it? No. Not that I want to. Oh, right. <laughs> I'm full. Uh, let's build that hut right here.
Hello. Look at the vines on the floor here. Look at all of these seeds over here. Lermas, tree seeds, Amora. Those are pretty good trees. Nothing like the ones we already have. We're gonna skyrocket in our tree production when we unlock those. Hello. And hello. Anything to learn? No, offline and... Oh, hello. Terraforming task, anticipate future life forms, sensor may larva. I think we saw this one earlier. Oh, oxygen. <laughs> uh, oh, we need a silicone for that. Ah, uh, darn. It's a little bit early to eat that, but we're gonna have to. No silicon. I know we had one of these screens just up the hill, but drone vis we don't even have drones yet, but we got the drones visualization rocket. Still no fertilizers. Hmm. Well, this was a cool hut. Let's see if we can make our way home from here. I'm pretty happy with the hall. We got the one zeolite. That's it. There's so much more to explore down here, but I think maybe tomorrow we're going to look into the rover. Uh, well, I guess it won't be tomorrow. I guess later this week we will look into the rover. Yeah, we looked over this hill before and we saw... Yeah, that. Not the stuff we just saw. Alright, we got only like couple minutes here, but let's go check. These look like launches that just burrowed into this, the roof. Two, oh, wait, what was that? A trade space rocket blueprint. That's awesome. Offline, locker storage. That also has the same blueprint. I don't need two of them. Yeah, this is a trade space. If we found this platform, we would have found that blue chip, even without that robot right beside it. All right, now we need to get back up there. Darn it. <laughs> All right, that wasn't too bad. Let's see about home. All right, so things on the to-do list is to maybe blow up some of those geodes or whatever they are, see what we can get, and make a rover, see how far we can upgrade it. I think we're going to need things like gas and stuff to do any upgrading. And zeolite, we're going to need that as a resource. I haven't seen any spawn in the world. We found one. But yeah. Oh, yeah, look, I can grab them. I have one more spot open. Oop. I think we need three to build our first fertilizer though. So, let's see if we have time to, we're just gonna go over time. GPS tier 4. That's the one I've been waiting for. That's the top tier 1. Uh, do we have room here? No, of course not. You go there. New container for junk. Take everything. We want those. Is that it? 
Yeah, alright, that's fine. We only need three. We also need two squash and one of these guys. Is that correct? Yeah, that is our first fertilizer, letting us make our first flower spreader. Let's get this going on. Now we're gonna use that guy right there, and we're gonna put a 400 percenter in there instead. Right here by the base. Oh, uh, more water, huh? Well, we got that going on, no problemo. Finally, some progress. First flower spreader. All right, well, we will come back. I mean, I'm not gonna wait for a bulb to sprout all the way to max. We'll, we'll come back next time and we'll take a look at these flowers. But until next time, have a good time. Ooh, there they are.